Well, we are downtown yet again. As you can see, we got a ton of traffic down here, but it's midday down here and I have a little treat for you guys. So all you guys that seen the magnet fishing video where we came down here and I caught the shotgun shell, literally crazy fine, craziest fine yet to date, by the way. Here, that's too loud. People be sipping on that scissor yet again. But yes, we are back at the old Urban Creek. And if you guys watched the last video, you will know that right here in this spot right here is where I caught that shotgun shell. Caught, found, whatever you call it, because this is called magnet fishing. If this is your first time watching one of my magnet fishing videos, you're in for a treat, let me tell you what. Because today we got my pops coming along with us. This creek is extremely long. It goes underneath what is known as Main Street. There's a ton of traffic. There's a ton of foot traffic here. As you can tell, someone's been, oh, I see what they've been doing. Yep, see, they've been mixing the old scissor with the OJ. I see you out here. But anyways, this weekend there's a huge downtown just festival going on. It's a, it's a three day festival and this area is gonna be packed. So I wanna fish it really hard, see if we can find any good lost treasures, guns, knives, who knows, who knows. Before the big crowds come here and I'm not able to touch it, plus I wanna fish it before the big crowd comes here in hopes that they all lose something yet again in the creek and I'll come back after the huge festival and we'll fish it again. And if you guys haven't, we have all kinds of sweet summer teas available on the site. If you want to pick up a duck summer tea or a duck's hat, I will link both of these products in the description below. Go check out what we got. Everything you guys purchase from the site goes directly to supporting the channel and helping me do crazy stuff like this. So I think I, I haven't got to show you guys my new truck. I think I showed you guys when I was going to North Dakota, but here's mine. And then here's the old dad. Dad's got the same one. I haven't got to show you that either. What's up? Couldn't find you. There's a truck over there that looks like yours. A truck over here looks like yours. See, everybody wants our trucks, man. What magnet do you have today? 350 pound pole neodyne rare earth magnet. Well, he 350 pound pole, and then he bought me another 350 pound pole. And then we got the big rectangle magnet. So we're just we're all we're all geared up. We're ready to go. Old dad's getting after it already. He's excited to come down here. It's crazy, because it is exciting. You never know what you're gonna find. There's always something to be found down here. I literally found a 12 gauge shotgun shell, not shot, down here in a random urban creek. If you haven't seen that video after this one, go to the channel and go watch that video. It's really good. As you can see, I'm hobbling around. I got a bum foot, took a bad, huge splinter to that sucker so I'm gonna be hobbling around so it's gonna be nice having dad's help with an extra magnet like last time most of the stuff was up along the edge so hopefully we have the same luck and we find uh, that it's really easy just to drag it up along the edge like this the current usually pushes stuff to the edge so, this is what we're gonna find a lot of. Just nasty, nasty metallic dirt. I don't know if it's just like rust or what, but it's nasty. Felt like I grabbed something there. Oh, what's that? That is a piece of metal of some sort. Put that in the old bucket. Well, I'm still just dragging the edge. I'm going to start on the edges. Seems like that's where I had good luck last time. Here we're underneath the bridge. Like I said before, this is where me and a bunch of friends used to skateboard when I was younger. So that's what gave me the original idea to actually come down here and do some magnet fishing. If you're going to magnet fish people, find a really, 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 really populated area that people populate around small, small bodies of water, not big bodies small bodies of water. Oh, there's something. Ew. We have a bobby pin, one nail, two, that's a screw, and then another piece of metal and that nasty mud again. Yuck. Look at that. 
watering the old plants. These are old plants right here. So this is the uh, this is Main Street. This is a road. This is a road. So you can see how populated this little place is. I'm telling you. Ooh, what in the heck is this? More bobby pins. Look at that. Bobby pins. Find a lot of bobby pins. <laughs> bobby. <laughs> so we finished all this. Found some bobby pins. Only spent about 10 minutes doing it because this is the area that I magnet fished last time I was here. So from right here on, I haven't done any of this. So this is where people sit for concerts and whatnot that they have up on that stage right there. So everybody sits here, everybody sits in all this grass on the grassy knoll for concerts and whatnot. So I'm excited about this area, should be good. That guy there's taking him a little cat nap. That'd be nice, lay under a tree. Take you a little cat nap. It's a nice day out. Come on now, see I'm just dragging it this whole edge here i'm just dragging because that's where stuff stacks up come on give us something good oh there's something there well feels like i got something on there what the hell look at that spoon <laughs> look at that found that's a good old spoon now i can go eat my applesauce all right well that's the find of the day so far is a spoon Come on, we can find something better than that. This dude walked down here and he was like, what are you doing? I'm like, oh, just throwing a magnet around trying to find something. He was like, well, hell, you can't find silver, gold, money, or anything. Why are you wasting your time doing that? I didn't tell him I had a YouTube channel. So if you guys appreciate the awkward moments that Bobby has to go through, make sure you drop a big old thumbs up right now because let me tell you, the awkward moments in these situations can be extremely real. Like, we still have old dudes sleeping there taking a cat nap. So, you know, it is what it is. Found that down there? What'd you get? How's that magnetic? Oh, it is. What is it? There's tin on it. I don't know. No way. <laughs> that is... What did dad find here? New Zealand. Hold on, let me wash it off. Okay, so it says New Zealand Elizabeth 2006. Looks like it says 10 and has a crown on it. So it's Queen Elizabeth, New Zealand. American money, New Zealand money. I don't know, it says 2006. I don't. So if anybody knows what this is, if you can see that, what is this? Drop a comment down below. Like, oh yeah, that's this type of coin. Dad just found that. Good find. <laughs> that's sweet. So here it is. Take a gander. My camera won't do much justice here. It's really bright out. But New Zealand, Queen Elizabeth on it, 2006. I don't know my coins. But uh, Dad don't know his coins either. But if you know what this is, drop a comment down below. Let me know. But that is that is definitely the find of the day. Good job, Dad. Heck of a find. I always find the good stuff. He does. Pretty soon you won't want me coming with you. No, we want him with us. Yeah. Last time, you guys haven't got to see the Milford video. We went and caught big, big catfish. It'll be coming up probably this week. Or you already seen it. I don't know. But Dad latched onto a big one and let me tell you it is so much fun catching them big old blue cats so we're gonna get back after it again me and dad moved now this is where we're at now the luck was slowing down at the other spot dad found the coin and uh luck just really shut down so this is going to be a really silty muddy bottom which is not going to be too much fun compared to the other spot because the other one was all concrete bottom but we're going to give it a whirl Huh. 
Come on, let us find something decent. So, I think again I'm going to run the edge. Run it right along the edge of this bad boy. Never know. You just never know. Either got something or there's a lot of mud on it. What is that? I got something here. We got a bolt. Oh, there's a lot of metal down there. Oh boy. Well, we got, this is loaded with metal. Well, look at that. Big chunks of metal. Just big old chunks of metal. Look at that. Holy moly. Well, that's good. Oh, geez. Holy cow, that sucker. Oh, God. Oh, Ooh, man, that magnet's strong. 350 pound pull magnet, guys. That sucker does not mess around. This sucker looks small, but I'm telling you, it will pick up 350 pounds. No lie. Bank. There we go, Joseph. There we go. Yeah. Yeah. Well, same thing. Second throw, just tons of metal. I mean, tons of metal. Probably gonna fill the bucket up today with just nothing but scrap metal here. Go turn it in and get us some money. Well, yet again, huge nails, big bolts. Look at that, big old bolts. At least we're finding stuff. It's not like exciting stuff, but I mean, at least we're finding stuff, I guess. There we go. That's a good throw. Hello. Well, here we are, and I just pulled up this. What is that? Big old metal. I don't know what that is, and another big old nail. What's that? Got you a can, it looks like. Oh, you dropped it. Old rusty can? No money in it. <laughs> Well, I'm sitting here throwing this magnet around and I look down and I'm like, what is that? So I don't know what's going on here. Rahab and Aaron G52015, you have brought down some some seashells and you have made a little, a little, uh, don't know what this is, but there's some crosses, seashells, and a Finding Nemo deal. Hmm. So Rob and Aaron G. Big shout out for whatever is going on here. Woo, it is a hot one out here. I'm about to go jump in the old water park with all the kiddos over here because it is hot. Well, that's going to wrap up the day of magnet fishing. Definitely dad scored the coolest find of the day, which is this 10 cent piece Queen Elizabeth, New Zealand is what it says. But if you guys like these magnet fishing videos, you know what to do. Drop me a huge, huge thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't guys we're going to keep these magnet fishing videos rolling throughout the summer you guys seem to love them i love doing it gets me out gets me in the city where i'm hardly ever filming because you guys know me i love to fish and i love to hunt most of all and i can't hunt in the city limits so so this is our opportunity to get in the city and make a video or two thank you for watching y'all we'll see you on the next one subscribe don't forget have a good one y'all peace Bro. I don't even understand how my plug talk Pick him up in the space cool, I don't let my plug walk New freak had to cut my other little b**** talk